Welcome to this week's episode of 60 Seconds with the Superintendent. Well, in partnership with the Sandy Hook Promise, this week in our district is Say Something Week. Let's head over to Kinsner Elementary School to meet up with one of our brand new school counselors, Mr. Lawrence, and some students to learn more about this week. Let's get started. The team with Mrs. Kandow and Mrs. Sislowski and Mr. Shively, they're an awesome team. So we were able to kind of have our virtual meet and talk a little bit about how do we empower the students through uh, Say Something Week and we came up with different slides and presentations on how to empower the students to kind of speak up for each other to solve their own problems as well as connecting with the Sandy Hook Promise and seeing how it relates and connects to lessons that we're teaching through Second Step as well. First we start with what is our mission and vision at the school at Kinsner as well as the entire district we talk about pride. We talk about being prepared, respectful, inclusive, determined, engaged. And Say Something is that opportunity to really pinpoint on being respectful and inclusive. It's Say Something Week. And so we were looking at in what ways can we promote being inclusive while doing Say Something? And how is that connected to what teachers are talking about currently? And so we met with students. We had a student announcement and the students were able to talk about what each aspect of Say Something was and what we would be doing each of those days. Wearing words with writing or eyeglasses or sunglasses or even the bracelets that we wear for the entire week and how that stands for being inclusive and supporting others through hard times. My favorite part of this week is, is the collaboration. Uh, a lot of the students are starting to kind of figure out and work together on things and and they're aware that you know not everybody's always comfortable and what can I do to make others feel comfortable. The best part of participating is that you're showing that you can see something, that you can um, stop something if you see it. It feels great though that everybody knows that you can't bully and it's wrong and you shouldn't do it. It gives me confidence to say something to someone if I see something happening because it's the right thing to do. It just has a different feel during Say Something Week where students are coming to each other and they're saying, hey, I really like your shirt. You know, I, I'm, I'm going to be an upstander today. And like they're saying these things to each other, not even to us. And I'm hearing it in the hallway pass and I'm like, wow, I didn't even I didn't even get to teach you that lesson yet. But you're already talking about it. So I know that the conversations are happening in the classroom with the teachers at other schools um, and with their parents at home. So it's really impacting everybody. Say Something Week is phenomenal. One of our core values as a district is to build strong connections so that we can make sure our district is a great place to belong for all students and staff. These past five days this week, Say Something Week, it's just not about this period of time. It's about what we do each and every day in Strongsville City Schools, standing up and standing together for everyone. As always, thanks for watching and go make it a great Mustang week.